Hi, this is Mike from Microsoft Oxygen Reviews and How To, and today we're going to take a look at how to remove problematic devices on your Bluetooth on Windows 10. Keep watching to find out more. Okay, so on Windows 10 you've got a problematic Bluetooth device which you cannot remove. So just to show you, let's double click on the icon there, bring up our Bluetooth devices. So as we see in our audio section here, we've got the Ditto Audio. Now this is how it should remove normally. So we'll click on Remove Device. Are you sure you want to remove it? Yes. And there we go. Very simple, it's gone. So let's try and do the same thing with our uh, Boltune Bluetooth headset. And we'll choose Remove Device. Are you sure? Yes. And it'll say Removing Device. The fact that it's not going straight away obviously leads you to the assumption that there's something not quite right on Windows is struggling. And as you can see, it's come up saying Windows Remove has failed. So there's various options you can try and do in here. One of the things I prefer to do, which is uh, quite a simple one to do, is go down to the Start flag, press the right click button, and then go into Device Manager. So we've got our Bluetooth devices here. So if we click on Bluetooth, you'll see that device is no longer showing there, even though it says it's connected, etc but it's not showing. So what we want to do is go to view and then click on show hidden devices. Now what we can do is just basically go through and delete all the individual devices. So we'll click on that one first of all, right click and choose uninstall device. And I'll say all the usual stuff. So click on uninstall. And basically we go through and do that on pretty much all the devices there that are shown in hidden. And what you can do as well is actually just get rid of some of the other bits and pieces in here. So just go through, manually click in all the devices. A little bit time consuming. Get rid of generic radio, uninstall device. and we'll basically go through. If it comes up with an option saying delete driver for this device, do tick that box and click uninstall. And as you go through, you'll see uh, chunks of the Bluetooth stack are being removed. We've got one left there, so uninstall device. So that is it, now our Bluetooth is gone and down in the bottom here, we can see that the icon is now gone as well. So what you can do now is now either go back to your devices here, which you should see that the problematic device is now gone. So we'll close that down now. And now we'll do scan for hardware. And it'll now pick up the Bluetooth and also reinstall the drivers and reinstall the, uh, the Bluetooth stack. So we can get all of our normal stuff there. Click on the icon again to bring up our devices. And now you can see the, the problematic device in audio has now disappeared. So now you can go ahead and now and try and repair any problematic devices. So for instance, you could reinstall the Boltoon headset and you should find that it adds and removes as it's intended to. So there we go, that's a pretty easy way of sorting out your issues with Bluetooth devices and uh, hopefully it helps some of you. Okay, so there we go, there are some uh, relatively easy ways of removing problematic Bluetooth devices from your Windows 10 installation. Quite often this happens if you've had possibly two different Bluetooth adapters, so say for instance one built in from the motherboard and possibly one which is a, a dongle of some sort. And the way that the devices get paired, they kind of link to that particular device, so if the device is no longer present on the system, it can't remove it because it can't communicate with it. Yeah, a little bit of a convoluted way around it, but certainly gets the job done. So hopefully this is going to be helpful to some of you. If it is, don't forget to hit that like button. If you want to see more content like this on a regular basis, hit the subscribe button and the chime icon, and you'll be notified of future video releases. So I've been Mike, this is Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To, and hopefully we'll catch you in the very next Bluetooth video. Thanks for watching.